Hey guys, Sigma here with another SIG tutorial. Today I'm going to be talking about the apiary pipe. First, we need to know how to craft it. Crafting this bad boy requires a diamond pipe, which is two diamonds with a piece of glass in the middle. Then we need some propolis, and those come from centrifuging various um, bee byproducts. We're going to go ahead, and I have it set up here along this pump, right? So, I put a bunch of common bees in there, and I need to s organize them out to find out what I've got, because I want, if I'm trying to do some purebreds, or if I'm trying to get some cultivated to, to move it on. And these are just sample bees. This is, um, this is uh, just a little system to sort it out. You could also set it up if you wanted to try and populate an apiary, which this isn't the purpose of that. So, the chest was in here. You look at this little um, filter here. So, the red filter, we apply it so that it's common and cultivated. So all the bees that came into here are going to be common and cultivated. This one I actually analyzed already, so you can see that it's a common cultivated hybrid. If we analyze this guy, it'll show that it's also that. Now if you wanted to, you could actually set the filter. So if you wanted all these bees that are common, they could all come through like this as well. So let's kick those guys off. And now we've got a common, two other common drones here. Let's pull him out so that you can see how this is working. And he's a common meadows. So now we'll pump these guys through here. And now they all should go through to that red filter. Here comes the first one. Right into the red filter. Here comes the second one. Because it's a common bee and it has the correct inactive um, that's a hybrid, it'll come through here. So, there you have it. That was a very quick, very short SIGtorial on the Apiaris pipe. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope it helps you figure out some other more complex machines. One of the other things I'm going to be doing is I'm going to show you how you can set it up so that if you are trying to breed certain for certain characteristics and apply those filters. So stay tuned for the next SIGtorial where I'll show you how to do that. Keep on Minecraft and Minecraft.